She may not be ready to attend any CE classes just yet, but we've got a very special person we'd like you to meet. Courtney Oliver is a 12 year old with big dreams of becoming a veterinarian, and she's well on her way to achieving that goal. All thanks to a mentor who recognized her brains, her drive, and her passion for helping animals. Candy Oliver knew early on that her daughter Courtney was not going to be your average child. I remember when she was two and three, she would be up till uh, midnight sometimes reading. She started to read very young. Like many veterinarians, ever since she can remember, Courtney's passion has been veterinary medicine. Well, the reason I wanted to become one is because, you know, I live around animals and I thought, you know, what if there's a sick animal out there? I can save lives. I can save these animals' lives. And I think that really motivated me. Courtney, who's homeschooled by her mom and dad, didn't want to wait to pursue her dreams of becoming a veterinarian until her college years. She wanted to start a little earlier than that, immediately, in fact. So she went to her number one mentor, her family veterinarian. I remember the first time meeting Courtney. She used to come in quite often with her mom when they would bring in their animals to come to our clinic for care. And every time she came in, she always had a picture for me or a drawing about how she wants to be just like me and she wants to be like Dr. Shoemaker. She'd draw my animals and I still have all the pictures posted on my bulletin board. And so, and just the dedication that she had and the enthusiasm she had wanting to always come in the back, always asking if she could come back with me while I gave shots to her animals or did little things or come back and see all the rest of the animals in the clinic. She really, from that point, she just had drive. If it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be where I am today. I wouldn't be here filming this or anything. I wouldn't be a veterinary assistant. I wouldn't have the opportunities that I have today. You heard right. Courtney is now a certified veterinary assistant. Part of her homeschool education involved taking online courses. She helps out at the clinic every way she can, always under the guidance and supervision of her mentor. Through online classes, she completed all coursework and exams to earn her veterinary assistant certificate. Dr. Shoemaker says she wants other veterinary professionals to realize the difference they can make in a child's life. You know, there's a lot of thoughts out there that maybe the clinic's too busy or, you know, we're, we're understaffed and we can't even keep up with the staff that we have. How do we have time to bring in a volunteer or a job shadow? How do we have time to help these children out who want to have this passion? And really all I can say to them is that it's help for our future and it's help that we'll be able to have veterinarians in the future that are passionate and that enjoy their career. So take that time, whether it's just a second in the day to call a child, bring them into the clinic for a couple hours. It doesn't take much, but it can mean the world to them and it can mean whether they become a veterinarian or don't. Courtney intends to follow her dream and will not give up until she's a veterinarian like her mentor, Dr. Shoemaker. I just like the feeling that you get when you help that animal, you know? Um, when you help it and it's all better and you see it in that kennel sleeping and it's, you just think, wow, I, I just saved a life. The AVMA convention is doing its part to try and show kids all the cool stuff about being a veterinarian. Courtney was on hand yesterday to help hand out diplomas to future vet graduates and give them a few tips on pursuing their dreams. It sounds really cool and I think it's a great way to you know, show kids that being a vet is not just bandages. It is really diagnosing and surgeries, and I think it's a really good way to teach the kids and make a future generation that I think that is very important.